I was with Penny Marshall. I was doing a show called Here Comes Bronson. And we were lying in the sun, and she came back and she said, I just talked to my brother. And he wants to know if you want to do a series on the odd couple. I said, who's your brother? She said, Gary Marshall. I'm, I don't know him. I said, no, I don't do another series. I'm a serious actor. I don't do comedy. I don't do series anymore. I had bad experience with it. And that was it. It wasn't until I did a play that I, it took me 10 years to get on. It was written for me in the wintertime, commuting, freezing my butt off. The director was terrible, couldn't get him fired, and it lasted four performances. The title was longer than the run. And I thought, Psh, what am I, crazy? I'm 46 years old. I got like $12,000 in the bank. I got two kids. I did own a couple of houses. I, had, you know, I could work all I wanted, but I uh, couldn't make the real money. So I said, oh, that with it, I'll do the odd couple. So I called and that's what I did. And I said I was interested, and then they sent me the script. My agent, they, my agent then got another call about it. I think they revived it the following year. They were looking around because Tony wanted Mickey Rooney. We had been doing it on the road with him. And Gary wanted me. And they had said to Gary, but he doesn't do comedy. He said, yeah, I saw him do it. So I thought he'd see me do Replace Walter. But no, he'd seen me. He said, I saw you with Ethel Merman. And she was singing to you and spinning all over you, and you never showed it. And I said, that's a good actor that doesn't show the spit. <laughs> that's why he gave it a boy. It was as funny as the play. There was that one moment he says, he said, we're having an argument, he says, you can eat off my floor. I said, you can eat off my floor two eggs, I have a tuna sandwich. And it just knocked me out. It was very funny. Jerry Belson and Gary had two fine writers. <laughs>